Hey everyone, welcome back to Crown Geek. In this video, I will be explaining that how to increase the VRAM that is a video RAM graphics on Windows 10 or Windows 11. Doing this will be surely increasing your FPS and boosting your PC performance. Now before proceeding, first you need to find out that which graphic card you are using. So this will be applicable for both Windows 10 and 11. The process is almost same, the steps are almost same. On Windows 10 or Windows 11, make a right click on the Windows icon. And from the list, click on Settings. On Windows 10, you have to click on System here. And on Windows 11, you will be also getting the same options. Now scroll down at the very bottom, you will find Advanced Display Settings. Just look for it and click on it. And then on the left hand side, you will see display adapter properties for display. Uh, click on it again. And now the properties box will be coming up. At the top, it will display your graphic card. I'm using the AMD, it's showing me AMD. But if you're using the Intel, it will display with Intel. And now below that, if you find here dedicated video memory. So this is only 512 MB right now. Okay. So what you can do, now close it, we have made a note of it and now close it again everything. On Windows search, you have to type REG edit and from the suggestion you have to choose registry editor. The registry editor box will now be up and here you need to follow the path that I am going to show you step by step. So make sure you follow the right pad and do not make any mistake. Here you just click on H key local machine, double click on it, and then double click on software. Now here in the software, you need to look for your graphic. So in the previous step, you find out that I have AMD. So if you have the AMD, then you need to look for AMD. But if you have Intel or any other, then you have to look for that. So if I see here, I can find AMD. Just make a double click on it. And now make a right click on AMD, hover up to new and then click on key. Now name this key as GMM, then double click on it and from the right hand side you will see this by default value. Now make a right click on the blank space, hover up to new and then choose dual 32 bit value. Now you need to rename it as dedicated segment size once done double click on it to open it and here is the value data the value data will be the same that we need the vram on our pc so how you need to choose that what kind of vram your pc should have so this all totally depends on your ram okay i have made a chart if you see here if you have one gigabyte of ram then you have to go and choose 128 MB. If you have 2 GB of RAM, then 256 or 6 GB 1024. So this is the list I have given till 16 GB. Okay. Now, if you don't know how to check your RAM, then come to the search box and type system. From the suggestion, choose system information. And here you will see installed physical memory. So right now I have 16 gigabyte of RAM on my computer. So what I will do for 16 gigabyte it says 4096. So I will enter the value 4096 and then click on OK. Now I will close it and now you just need to make a restart and after that I'm pretty sure that you will find the changes on your computer. Now even you have to check your graphic card. If your graphic card is out to date or corrupted, then keep updating, keep checking for the update at least every month. It's very simple. Make a right click on the Windows icon. From the suggestion, choose Device Manager. The Device Manager will be coming up here. Double click on Display Adapters and your graphic card will be displayed here. Make a right click on it and choose Update Driver. Then go with search automatically for drivers. If there are any updates available, it will automatically update it. And after that, again, you can make a restart. 
hopefully this video will help you guys and if yes make sure you hit the like subscribe to the channel this is absolutely free and this will make my day if this works for you till then take care bye bye